this way? Yeah, it must be. I'm going around the circle like that. Coucou tout le monde, and welcome back to my channel. In the summer of 2016, my parents came to visit me in Paris, where I was living at the time, and we decided to take a road trip through Normandy. If you want to watch the first part of their visit, where I took them to some hidden gems of Paris, click on the video link somewhere on the screen or in the description box. Otherwise, to journey with us through the French countryside, keep watching and enjoy. One of the first places we stopped was Caen, that's C-A-E-N. In Caen, there are multiple churches that you can visit, as well as the Caen Castle, which you can see in the distance here. The next stop in our trip was only about 30 minutes away in a town called Bayo. Here, there was a super impressive cathedral that we visited before having dinner and spending the night. I also captured my very touristy looking parents being very cute and holding hands throughout this trip, so enjoy those clips as well. We also stopped at saint mer Eglise, which is another commune in France that's most famously known for a paratrooper who landed on a church. My dad was really excited to visit here and my mom poked fun at him the whole time. Hey mom, how are we? <laughs> Craziest. Or the a carnival with people hanging. <laughs> We are Saint Mary. Saint Mary with the hanging paratrooper who somehow lived. The German. Are you still filming? And yeah, and Dad who is somehow, really looking. Oh, Dad, look. Let's just film Dad because this is fun. Oh, there's a little carnival. Next up was the main objective of the trip, which was to visit the World War II beaches of Normandy as well as the Normandy American Cemetery. The Normandy American Cemetery is one of the world's best-known military cemeteries and honors American troops who died in Europe during World War II. In these clips, you can see the vast number of marble grave markers that make this cemetery so recognizable. From the cemetery, you can also catch glimpses of the beaches below. After walking around, we also visited the Normandy Visitor Center, where my dad signed his name in the guest book before we ventured out to explore the beaches some more. When we visited, it was the summertime, so there was a scattering of people enjoying the nice weather and the beach itself. It's hard to imagine how much history that these sands have seen. Another place we stopped was La Pointe du Hoc. This is a point with a 100-foot cliff overlooking the English Channel. During World War II, it was the highest point between the American sector landings at Utah Beach to the west and Omaha Beach to the east. Sea breeze. Further inland, there are also different dugouts and bunkers that you can walk through. Here's my dad living his best tourist life and taking photos. Yeah. Of course, the most beautiful view though was by the water. I hope you enjoyed taking this little road trip through Normandy with me. If you did, be sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe for weekly videos. You can also follow me on Instagram at EverythingSarah. Thanks again for watching and à la prochaine. See you next time. Hear the bells are ringing. Ding dong, ding dong. They've stopped ringing. They are still ringing. <laughs> they are still ringing. <laughs> It is eight o'clock. Stop the log. Okay, into the car we go. <laughs> into the car, go away. <laughs> you know, you're he's gonna. He's running into us, literally. Bonjour.